Hello, YouTube, and welcome back into some Let's Play Civilization 6. We are, we get, uh, oh no, we don't have a lava here. Um, to that end, you should almost never retire these in cities that don't have lavras because you don't get the borders. But I don't really care that much. From the light came light. We shan't care that much. I am trying to avoid medieval era tech. Uh, while we while we're waiting on this next era, oh, more. We did that wasn't too bad considering we hit our golden within the first like I want to say like ten turns of this era. Not too bad to only go over by six. At least in my opinion. So, if I put you here, not right now, the problem is, like, these cities don't have that food I'm looking for. There's a little too much tundra right here. This one all the way over here does. Three... This could be fine. Because it gets this. I suppose this city could have like the, these tiles and stuff. I could just have one food poor city. It'd be okay. So I think we're doing this. Is that too far? That might be too far. Picks up that. Yeah, which one of these wants to be St. Basil? Actually, this one looks like a fantastic St. Basil. This could be St. Basil Rur, actually. Then we really shouldn't put it there. We should put it here. Because we move away from the mountains and the dead tiles then. This is too close. Maybe this city goes here. And then we government plaza in between. So then we're looking at maybe that. Because <clears throat> then this guy still can grab this tile. Maybe we could culture bomb uh, Laventa if if they give us the uh, culture bomb from districts. I'd, I'd put a bad campus there just for a food tile, to be perfectly honest. Do you lose out on the volcano tiles? No. We're, that, that whole plan still works out. It's a little awkward wanting to do Rur Vet. I guess we don't care about Rur. Do we care about Rur? We're not going to do a space race, are we?
many hills. I guess this could be St. Basil's. That's probably fine. It's not a great plan. Um, I guess with the move back, then I'm back to settling here instead of here. That's just This is just kind of worse. And as long as that city gets St. Basil's, I'm pretty happy. So we're back to settling this because we get more food that way. That way, this city can actually justify having to build this extra district in addition to whatever else they want to. Um, and then we'll just hang out for a minute. Okay, that seems fine. Um, we could still get another city in here. This was the other Ruhr that looked really good. Um, that's just sort of a filler whatever city, but I think is fine because it gets some food and has marshes to grow. Um, so this is just functionally okay. Uh, there's a pretty big gap in between these, but I don't really think I want to put in another city there. It just doesn't have the food to do anything useful besides probably get to like pop four and just stop. So I think just three cities over there would be fine. Um, I think I said here for that city. So three, that's four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And then if we do, this is 10. Make that. 11. And then maybe 12. That's decent. I, I thought we'd maybe be able to get um, more cities than that. But uh, yeah, I, this, this is not, I'm not like married to this. This is actually a little bit better. With that configuration. Then these all belong to this. And this all belongs to that. And maybe they'll get a uh, lob rest somewhere. Okay, sweet. That's a plan. can grab my TOA. Yeah. Let's just grab these tiles from Persia. Otherwise, I could grab these. You should grab that. Or not. Another envoy. Wow, Mausoleum City. Oh well. I don't think we're getting Mausoleum. Yeah, I think we'll, well, do we want to, are we ready to pop our religion? I don't know, if, I actually don't know if we are, if I'm being honest. Don't know if we are. Time rolls over. Why hold on the profit for so long? Because it doesn't really do much. All right. Golden Age dons. Nope. No chance of losing Jesuit. 
<clears throat> All those are, are gone. All the main beliefs are gone. I don't think we really risk losing anything. Democracy. So we're staying in monumentality because we have a lot more expanding to do. That is era score. Because uh, of Tundra. And then this city's job is to always work that tile. Montego with Jesuit too, yeah, yeah, he's a, he's another good choice, but he's also he's good with that too, uh, in the same way that that he's good with uh, he's almost good with our same pantheon, right? Um, so that's part of why they have similar styles. <laughs> What's up, Mad Hatter? How you doing? So saving the profit for era score, um, partially era score, not really. Um, although it's convenient to have that in your back pocket towards the end of an age, I'm largely uh, saving it because I don't want to have to get rid of all of this religion on my own. I can just wait for my cities to get um, to get holy sites, and then they adopt it for free when you when you pop your profit. I just clicked a button. I just sent somebody somewhere. Oh man. I feel like I just sent somebody on a wild goose chase and I don't know who it was. Oh well. I think it's time to grab just a couple. I'm going to send him send this archer down here. A little worried about the barb situation. Uh, we have this guy who can be an archer. And then we'll grab that. That's our machinery boost. Why is it? There we go. So now we can finish apprenticeship. We can actually go to education as well and then go down to machinery. We do want to prioritize printing. I'm just going to get this city to start on the government plaza. We want the promotions, and I just don't want to, like, slack on it. Uh-oh. They dying. Hey, maybe we can steal those tiles. So we want a culture bomb, even though that seems kind of redundant as Russia. It's also, why would we not vote for it? Does the population limit the district's um, limit on districts applied to the government plaza? Yeah, sure does. Sure does. Oh, yeah, send out envoys too. There Thanks. No There's way. our theater square. They might die, but they also might not die. I'll take the risk. Okay, that's probably all I want to send out at the moment. I'm 
must have cleared it. That's good. Try going this way, I guess. I don't know how we're ever going to get there. Alrighty. Tips for, for for beginners. Expand wide. Make sure you're getting like 8 to 12 cities. Um, and just have fun with it. Play on whatever difficulty you can win and then just slowly work your way up. Love that merchant. He pays me to buy tiles. He fundamentally is like my favorite merchant. <laughs> because yes, that is an amazing value proposition. Are you kidding me, Persia? Get out of my way. Jesuit's feeling worse and worse because I still need to spend a bunch of faith on expanding. That scout will die, but whatever. We traded it for 20 iron, I guess. should sell our uh, strategics as well. <laughs> Crossbow. I've already done all that. Maybe you can get me a better road. All right, I think we're. it's time to start pumping out builders here. I know we don't have Liang or anything. Pyramids are still available somehow. to trade me marble. I don't want to... Not for this, though. I don't want your marble that bad. No. No. Of There's a nice flood for us, actually, increasing the yields. I'm trying to, like, create a path with multiple units, but this is very, very, very challenging. Yeah, the jersey colors are just colors. If 
This is another good spot to work work on builders. Can I show the ages of the other civs? Sure, they're all in standard ages. Yeah, I, I, I mean, I, I, if I have a, when I have a bunch of builders out, I will considering consider soothing uh, Granada um, to try to get some Alcazars going. But for the time being, I think, I think I just make their borders get ridiculous and annoying. So when I'm in position for that, I will definitely at least use them temporarily. But for now, I think we're happy. Yeah, Chichen's supposed to go here. That's that's the name of the game. Remember that people break down. I can't worry you. We're friends. I don't understand that. When is it worth it to attack the city state? Um, it just depends what you're doing. If you have the army anyways, or if you desperately need the space, those are good good times to do it. Yeah, I finished the theater square over here. Hey, that's the one we want. He is as the fall of a Oh, had I put that city in the middle of the mountains? <laughs> uh to grab to grab these tiles so that we could get free merchants and um generals. No worries. It's a good question. Definitely a bit of a head scratch unless you see the wonder. There are very honest people. Yep, see, we already have too many writers. Um, how many units do we have? I have three archers and one warrior, and what? How many scouts left? A couple. One, two, three, four, five, six. So two units and I can boost mercenaries. If I try to timed victory, like a score victory, I'm not a big fan of just waiting for the game to end. I, I kind of hate that. Vic it, I, to me, that's not even real a real victory type. happy with this aesthetics would be fine to run as well uh he may be <laughs> uh 
Uh, it's it's not the worst city for it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Obviously, that was eight, and then nine. It's okay. GM finally won a game nice. on Emperor after watching you and Potato. Sweet pay, P Brank. Thanks, man. I appreciate the uh, value for value. Thank you for the bits and congratulations. That's awesome. Uh, yeah, I know. I'm for sure happy to help, and I, I, I assume Potato's an awesome leader too. Uh, leader, <laughs> teacher. Although he could be a good leader. I don't know. I don't know. Potato new civ leader confirmed. That would be amazing. His 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 leader is his leader ability is haste buddies. <laughs> what would it do though? Hey butter knife, how you doing? that in there why not grants potatoes as a luxury oh my god that's so good <laughs> i know the russia tile grabs are so glorious few things make me happier than having obnoxious borders We're almost a 10 pop. I'm just trying, I'm switching text and things so often because I'm just trying to not overdo any of the boosts. Sweet. Cap just needs housing now. There we go. They can get to 10 pop for their next district. No idea where that settler's going. Not a clue.
So turn like 105-ish, Merchant Republic. Though. Hey. Yes, turn 100 save. Thank you very much. So this great library is available. So good for us. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, we're not going to get there. Okay, so don't think about that. Definitely want Moscow to get to 10. Either one of these getting to 10 is fine. Seems good. Oh my god, we're getting there. <laughs> He's settled more cities though, hasn't he? Oh, uh, see. See, by the time we get there. <sighs> Should have just let it go. Got debated by campuses. A few inventions have been. It's going to be impossible to support that city if it gets attacked. Just try, try not to go over any of our Eurekas. I'll chop that, then I'll move Magnus. Where's Magnus even want to go? Up here, maybe? <laughs> it's like, maybe they'll be gone now. Nope. So that's God's dead. Pop the scientist. Uh, we get that. We get that. I guess we might as well, because it's only classic or medieval. I was figuring I was I was gonna get both of these in just a couple turns. Spearman, not so much, because it's three, right? So, which could also hit both of these. Oh, oh yeah. yeah! You gotta get Swifty. You gotta get Swifty in here. The Swiftiest of raids. Thank you so much, Jack. I appreciate you. Welcome on in. And uh, you guys should go follow Jack. And watch some awesome uh, multiplayer shenanigans. How are your games today, bud? Thank you for the support. Thanks for the, the raid arena. Fine, YOLO. Military tactics, ship building, and celestial navigation. So that's actually perfect because these were the two I was going to do on my own. Perfect. All right, sweet. And that gives me somewhere to go with my science, which is nice. <laughs> Got an envoy there. Great. <laughs> That'll last. That'll last. There 
is nothing but a Connection issues, big problem multiplayer. I, I, I don't know how you have the patience for it, man. Like, setting up multiplayer games can be like pulling teeth sometimes. Uh, but uh, welcome in and thank you so much. I appreciate the support. How are we doing over here? Still gonna try. Still going to try to at least get a city over there. Almost ready for pop our religion. So there's one. They've got those three. So that, that one we need still. I still need two settlers. I still think we need our government first. I might not get that Cheech in. I'll be a little bit sad, but how are you not dead? Okay. Um, well. Gonna get my next district. This is fantastic for Russia. Not often great in other games, but amazing for Russia. We're really happy. Hey, Essie, welcome back. Uh, I, I don't know what we're doing yet. Somewhere between, we're, we're somewhere between space and culture. Is it gonna matter? I mean, that's gonna be seven. These are all seven. I'd rather have it in the Pingala city with that extra science. Oh, I could do the Granada thing. I should. I should. I just don't want to have to look at um, appeal too much for a change. Took Dance of the Aurora. If I, once I finish a few more holy sites, eh, we should probably pop our religion. Probably gone now. Nope. Mm -mm. Two archers. <laughs> Two archers he's mad at. And again, we're friends. So he needs to cool his jets. No, maybe. No, I'm not doing religion. I don't mind it, though, as a victory type. I think it's fine. Theater squares. Maybe the wonder guy will pop up. About to get our first artist.
Temple. Well, <laughs> not sure what this is going to look like. This might just be one city. I don't know. I suppose we'll deal with it later. Ever done a culture speed run? What would that look like to you, AQ? Um, I mean, we, we, we've, we've had fast culture victories. I, and I usually try to finish the games as quickly as I can. I play Civ the opposite of way, uh, or the opposite way. Never mind. There's a joke in there somewhere. Don't worry about it. We'll just skip it for now. So it's 120 turn culture win. Yeah, it's cool. I haven't watched that yet, sadly. Any tips on part fighting a proactive war without strategic resources? Uh, find de defending them. Since rage units are so good, uh, but trying to take out land with them was difficult. Yeah, that's pretty much it. And I think that's part partly by design. Um, that's just that's my impression too, and that's just kind of how the game works. What my best was, uh, I think it was Coupe when when Coupe just came out, and it was probably sub 150 or sub something like that. I don't remember. It was something stupid fast, but it wasn't 120. I've never done a, a 120 culture victory. That's crazy. Pretty, pretty much, pretty much cope. <laughs> pretty much it. Is it possible to take cities with with uh, crossbows? Technically, no. Um, I mean, they're good at they're they're, they're good at shooting walls, um, but you can't actually take a city with a ranged unit. Tactics mean do we shall not cease from. Okay, into exploration. That's going to help us build our districts. We can run conscription's worth a few gold. I'd prefer limes, but we're working on builders when possible. So I think here we can bring in like theater square adjacency there. It's not fantastic, but then gold from um, city states from envoys makes a lot of sense. It's probably fine then. Two markets. I don't think I have. Yeah, I don't really have the commercial hubs for that at the moment. That's okay. I can get one here now. It needs to erupt more. Oh, Killa is here, huh? Killa's so good. It's got to be being built already, though. Huh. Huh. 
This is a weird game. <laughs> I don't know what to make of it, really. That's all you can do? I don't like that. I don't think I like that. Wow, Persia is everywhere. Holy cow. Take it easy there, buckaroo. Are you kidding? It's my pledge to move my troops from Persia's empire has, has failed. My scout... My two archers moving through his land, and he has 700 military strength. I think military strength should be calculated in that. That's ridiculous. Oh, is that to culture? Thanks. That's kind of the road I'm looking for anyways. Well, maybe not. Maybe this? Nah, this is good. I'll take my that. Man. What's my favorite wonder in terms of appearance? Uh, built or natural? Scoop. Welcome in. Thank you so much for the follow. Appreciate it. Welcome, welcome. We are, uh, gosh, just 90 away. We are 90 follows away from 10,000. That is super cool. Thank you all so much. Is there a bonus getting rode between cities besides unit movement? Um, I mean, trading posts with your enemies matter for combat strength. Um, trading posts matter for extending future trade routes. Um, but I'm mostly I'm looking at roads. I can't believe that promise is broken. Come on. Come on, game. Cahokia would be valuable from a uh, housing perspective. I don't really want to put a dam and then like industrial zone shenanigans. Two, four, six. But we're here. Two, four. Nope. So it would be these four cities. Eh. Eh. I'll get that for the free spread. So we have holy sites here, here, here. We're going to have one there in four turns. They don't have one. They're going to have one in three turns. And then I should probably wait for that one to finish before popping it. Although I don't have to. Unless I like chop it out over there or something.
Let's see if we can get it. How's this Chijin coming? Uh, it is definitely coming. People can have I have a few chops. I guess let's move Magnus now. You don't need to be there anymore at all. So what could I chop for them? I can chop stone. And then two woods tiles, three woods tiles. Interesting. I think I'm hard teching printing, even though I'll eventually do it. I want that tourism boost now. That's fully loyal now. Or at least rising. All right. Um, yeah. This is uh, expand and economize. We're doing so, albeit a little bit slower than I would normally like. Uh, still doing quite fine. I think we're actually going to need even more cities than I'm thinking uh, maybe just to like one up here to make sure we can do the whole Rapa, Rapa nanigans all around there with uh, Moise. That'd be nice. And since I'm not getting as many cities over here as I thought, maybe that would be fine too. I uh, definitely want to get this one soon-ish. We have good campuses already, but better campuses are needed. Just more of them are needed. Really would like to get this Chichen, although it might be a bit tough um, given that he's well on his way. We are three turns away from starting it ourselves though. So, yeah, uh, that'll do it for this video, and we will see you all in the next one. Hopefully you're enjoying the series. If you're watching this over on YouTube, I do appreciate it. And don't forget to stop by twitch.tv slash the game mechanic. Come say hi to some person on the internet. We are pushing for 10,000 follows here and 10,000 subs on YouTube. So please follow, sub, and do all that stuff. Thank you so much for your support. Thanks for everything you guys do, and we'll see you in the next one.